My name is Bashar Guliana. I arrived to Australia in 2015 uh, with my wife and four children through the humanitarian visa. I grew up in Baghdad. I studied architecture there. I started working there. When the security system in Baghdad collapsed totally, we decided to resettle in Erbil, north of Iraq. I had to start my career from nothing there. I established my own firm, architectural firm there. My living standards in Erbil were relatively high. We designed and built our new home there. All our children were attending private schools. We thought we had it all. But in June 2014, ISIS seized Mosul. There were fear everywhere. You can smell the fear in the air. It was quite difficult to us because we thought that we would be next on ISIS plan to come to the city. So then I decided to leave everything behind and flee the country. In July 2015, we have been informed that we have been granted the visa to Australia. We are extremely happy. On 16 of August 2015, we arrived to Melbourne Airport. There were hundreds of people waiting there for us. I haven't seen my sister for over 20 years. I haven't seen my parents and brothers for more than 10 years. So it was quite emotional. From day one, I arrived to Australia. I was committed to find me a job. Actually, it was so good for me and for my family to, to find a job that related to my profession and to think that I know to do the most. We were astonished, me and Suha, how quickly our children resettled here in Australia and adopted into schools and found their way so quick. I found that it was a really smooth transition. Everyone was really welcoming and friendly. This past year has been full of exciting experiences and just getting to know my school and my community and improving myself and how I could help the people around me. Australia is an amazing country to live in. It's full of opportunities and new challenges. I have so many big scale dreams in my head to get registered as soon as possible so I can establish my own business. In that way, I can employ others, helping them to reach their dreams I would like to thank everyone who supported us so far. We feel, as a family, we feel so blessed that we're here today. We can live our dreams here in Australia. We are looking forward to that day to be able to help other new arrivals, to help them define their own lives, to find their own way in this magical place, Australia.